What's going on guys? So we're back out here with the Armor Creighton. It's gonna be the 1 8 scale. It's gonna be running on 4S, a 4S LiPo. Uh, it's gonna be, I think it's gonna be pretty much all stock uh, gearing. It's gonna have an upgraded, uh, I think it's an HBL 599 uh, servo, the MKS, I believe. Um, so that's pretty much what we're running today. And it has a little bit, little cheapy, uh, cheapy remote, a little cheap remote. So this is going to be the, this is going to be the uh, Extreme Basher, the EXB Armor Creighton one uh, scale. So it's actually pretty quick for uh, only running on 4S, to tell you the truth. Especially compared to the Armor Notorious, also pretty much the same thing as the Armor Outcast. So that was full speed right there. That's full speed right there. So it's probably hitting about 40 miles per hour, I would say. Pretty close to it. No, no GPS, just eyeballing it. Maybe 35. Uh, so it's gonna be the first armor crate I've ever owned. I uh, bought it off of Offer Up. Actually, it's gonna be Facebook Marketplace. Uh, I'm not sure if you can tell in the video, but it's gonna have a little bit bigger tires in the rear than in the front. Uh, so in the rear, it's gonna have the same tires that come on the. Whoops. So it's going to have the same tires that come on the uh, Armour Notorious or Outcast. Uh, as you can tell, it's going to be a little bit smaller tires in the front. So I think it's going to be the, I'm not, I think they, they call them the, the D-Boots. I think they call them D-Boots. That's going to be in the front. And we got dogs coming to, uh, let's ho hopefully they, they don't try to chase the car. And ruin our fun that we're having over here. Oh, keep coming over here, go around. Let's see if they try to chase it, they're getting close. It's full speed right there. Yeah, so it's actually it's actually pretty quick for running on 4S. Yeah, it looks like they're good. All right, not gonna chase this. It's good. So I I can only imagine putting this thing on a 6S. It seems like this guy has this, these dogs trained pretty good because they're actually just, uh, he, he t told them to, s to sit and watch and they're pretty much sitting and watching us. That's, that's pretty cool. All right, I'm gonna wait. See where he goes. Oh shoot! All right, I'm just gonna drive over here so he can pass if he wants to pass. I'm not sure if he's trying to go through or just waiting on me. That's gonna be full full throttle right there. Yeah, he has those dogs trained really good. Here, you guys want to check him out? Right there. Looks like, look like, uh, almost like Mastiffs. Oh, I don't know. Oops. Almost hit the tree. 
That's what happens when you record with one hand and you try to drive with the other hand. So as you can see, we have a pretty big open park over here to drive this thing. I just have to be careful of those little uh, manholes right there. If I hit one of those things going full speed, going full speed, it'll tear this thing up. It's little trees over there, over there. See the little tree right there in the middle of the grass. Yeah, he has his dog training real good. All right, he's he's walking through. All right, guys. So that's gonna be it for this video. Like I said, it's gonna be the uh, Armor Creighton, one six scale, uh, running on 4S. I believe it's gonna be just a regular, be a, a um, regular uh, stock engine and servo. Uh, but it's gonna be the uh, BLX. Or sorry, it's gonna be the um, EXB, the Extreme um, Extreme Basher. All right, guys. See you in the, in the next video.